What's up? What's up, everybody? It's Saturday, and you know what that means. It's, well, you know what that means. Do I have to say it every Saturday? Oh my god, this is how to get on Saturday Morning Summons, by the way. Submit at SaturdayMorningSummons.com. And that's about it. Like, that will basically just ask you all the things that you need. Uh, so, let's get it started. Where are... I was gonna turn this off. That's not the thing that we turn off. Uh, this. And then, that. Nice. First account, we have a level 35 player, which means they're probably G3 RTA, so they need only G3... <laughs> means we're gonna get an LD5, aren't we? First account, LD5! Very exciting! Okay, who's the... Hold on. Where's the one for the first account? Yes, this one. This one. No stones. Loot Yuli. Luli You Luli Yulis. Nailed it. Maybe we should start it over. Luli Yulis, they're hoping to get. Units, they're hoping to get. Lucian Galleon, Dragons, Beast Riders, Phoenix, Chakram Days. I almost thought I was going to say good Dragons units. Dragons. Dragons units. Um, Lucian Galleon, Dragons, Beast Riders, Phoenix, Chakram Dancer. Brand new Kindle as an early Christmas present. Well, why transfer a game over when you can just start another account to play two at the same time? You're starting to sound like me. Um, since you talk of wanting to see more unusual units used versus always meta, I want to share in a side account. I found Dark Lizard Man helpful in TOA hard. No one ever seems to think about him. Dark Lizard Man. I don't know what the Dark Lizard Man does. Like, lizard stuff? Uh, oh, it says... Uh, AoE plus continuous damage three turns, counterattack when despair is nice. Only mystical scrolls I've ever used so far are the few that you get from after getting Lapis that you use every 15 minutes. Everything else are unknown quest scrolls. What'd you get from the Lapis scrolls? Oh, okay. You got those. Still a long way to go. I mean, I'm sure that they're missing like almost it. They're missing so many three stars! Wow, they have no, they have no fire four stars. There, we need one of him, right? You can't exist in Summoner's War in uh, 2020 without him. So they have a yeah, they got a Sabrina, apparently one of the first uh, first four stars. They're missing so much. Oh my god. Yeah. All right. Now it's even more exciting. Now it's even less exciting. <laughs> Congratulations, you've got your first Jawa on your account. I was gonna say, I like, it would be crazy if they did like a Star Wars version of this game. They do have one, it's just not as good. I know people can be like, hey, don't you call Galaxy of Heroes not as good. Isn't that game, like, really ridiculously pay-to-win? Like, well, it's Summoner's War in 2020. It's also ridiculously pay-to-win. Like, can't you just not even, because it's shard-based game, can't you just not even play if you're, like... I, I think it's worse than Summoner's War, actually, is what I'm saying. Like, from what I've heard from everyone that's actually played it and me, I, I did watch a few Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes videos. Like a handful. I actually played it like a long, like seven years ago, something like that. It's crazy. Um, it is one of the first shard collector games. It ruined it for every shard collector game after that. But yeah, there's a um, one of my channels. We were doing a lot of Lego Legacy Heroes unboxed videos, and the Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes, like they came from that game, and most of the people playing Lego Legacy were people that used to play Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes, or people that were playing both also. So. Yeah, there were a lot of, for whatever reason, the community migrated from that into the other one. Weird. Maybe they did a whole lot of ads on Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes, or maybe since it was they were both shard-based games, they went went from one to the other. I don't know, but just interesting. But yeah, uh, I'm pretty sure it's more pay-to-win than Summoner's War. Pretty positive. Like it's it's pretty pretty ridiculous. So. And to be honest, I don't think it's as good. I think it's just very stiff and very, like, not fluid. And it was kind of like a... Let's just put this game together because it's a licensed game and not really worry too much about the gameplay or anything. And then people just kept playing it, still played it, still played it, still spends it, still played it, so the game never died. 
Because a lot of those games die, and that is not one of the ones that died. So they just never fixed the animations. They never fixed a lot of the stuff in the game that I think should have been fixed. Uh, and it was just very... Janky? Is that a word? <laughs> it's very uh, stiff and not very fluid or... Uh, the animations just were not done very well, in my opinion. And there's a lot of stuff that is just not what you would consider to be in a premium mobile game. Like in one of the bigger mobile games, right? They have so much money, like, you would think that they would have fixed a lot of this stuff, but it, it wasn't. So. Anyway, that's just my opinion on it. That's just my take on it. But it's pretty aggressively ridiculous. Like, I don't know. It makes it makes Summoner's War seem free to play friendly. I, well, Summoner, yeah, it is. It, Summoner's War is more free to play friendly in that game, for everything that I've seen. Anyway, uh, we did get a few decent units though. We we did get Orion. Good. Good old Todd. Uh, we we got other ones, but I feel like the Orion was the uh, the biggest pull out of those. I was hoping for a little bit more, more premium stuff. Cause you got, did they get, wait, did they get a figure? Excuse me. Oh, they got, okay. Best Dragons B12 unit. Okay. Number two. And they, they didn't get one. We didn't get one. No, we didn't get one. Oh my God. Oh my God. That's not good. We need a water werewolf now. Well, they have three water Inugamis, so uh, I guess that's that's gonna have to do for that. How's it even possible? Oh my god! So we have three LDs. Hopefully, we get something good for early game, and then I don't think we're doing uh, any of these. Yeah. Three LDs. We we we. Nope. I was gonna exit out. I was gonna jiggle, but Darian's not bad for early game. If there's any time we want to get Darian, early game would be the time. I was gonna jiggle some stuff, but I guess not. There's nothing to really jiggle. We didn't get anything exciting enough to jiggle. <laughs> hey, let's jiggle some uh, living armors. That's gonna be the one. If this gets uh, if this gets an LD five. Then that's gonna be the one. Guys, did you hear? She is the best unit for Steel Fortress. Everyone's using her. Like, literally everyone watching this video right now is using her for Steel Fortress. I mean, who wouldn't be using that unit for Steel Fortress? Hey, that's a nice unit. Okay. That's what she said. She, she, she didn't say. She didn't say that. She didn't say that. See, this is actually nice for uh, Giants V12. So, or Giants and, and TOA as well. So that's basically going to make your Dark Lizard Man useless. I really hoped we were going to get some more crazy stuff here. I really did. And a water stick. But really, we didn't get anything crazier than that. You know, they're just going to go spam premium packs now. Some of them are useful, though, but... <laughs> I feel like we got some duds, man! I feel like some of them are really good, right? Because these units are really good. Uh, that's This unit's not that bad, actually. But some of them are just... Uh, like, you don't really use these for too much. I've seen people use him, don't get me wrong. I've seen people use him. He's kind of like a defense-based Jolton, but... Uh, with AoE Provoke, but... Yeah, anyway, let's go on to the... On to the second account. Account number two, we are over to the Europe server now with Neo Strake. He says, no dupes please, Leo CR, Rika, Orion. Orion. Oh, he's got the new he's got the new summoning portal. So we can test out the RNG. It's gonna be the same. It's not gonna be anything special. But we can test it out just in case. Very exciting. One transcendence. So we should get uh three. We should get roughly three on average from the, he's got he's got Street Fighter. Oh, he's got one Street Fighter. 
Okay, so we can see here what he's looking for. Right. Is he missing? He's really missing. Or he wants more or skill ups or something. So he wants some skill ups, is what it's looking like. Oh, he's also he's missing an Orion. Okay. So some are skill ups and some are. He doesn't have a Triana. Okay. He says he has a transcend. Hold on. Oh, oh, oh. He, uh, yeah, transcendence does not equal blessing. There you go. Oh, you know what? Here, let's do, instead of that, let's do the mysticals first. The idea is, it looks like he wants Leo, Ciara, Rika, Ryan, like a Bastic, like a Beast Riders, not Bastic, <laughs> Carol, Gaddy, any Hell Lady, preferably Beth, Amarna, maybe Arena Speed Lead. Okay. So maybe if we get a dupe from this, then we can use a blessing. We can pop those uh, wind scrolls after that. Since it seems like he wants wind units. That's at least the impression that I get. <gasps> this is actually new. He didn't have this, right? This is actually a new unit. Okay. Not that bad. So off to a great start. I mean, we, we, with that new summoning portal, we definitely pulled like 5,000 uh, Nat 5s already, as you can see. He's got a Molly. Molly's so hit or miss. Like, she's either very annoying or she doesn't really do anything. Based on how your RNG is that day. Try to use her for arena offense, or not, not arena, but you, uh, offense in anything, and her passive doesn't work, right? I mean, the heal part is going to work, but the, uh, the glancing works, doesn't work, we'll see. That summoning portal is awesome. It's just a nice new thing to look at, you know what I mean? I, you know what I would love if they did, um, if they just did skins for a lot of stuff, like skins for arena. What? I mean, that that's come to us. That's the easiest thing. I already did it. In, I already said it in a video. You know, here's the here's the best part about YouTube, is people don't remember anything. So I can literally just do a video copying like an old video, and I'd be like, hey guys, what about skins for arena? They'd be like. Wow, that's amazing. Bagel, they did skins for Guild Siege. Didn't you know that? Why are you stealing their, their ideas? For Arena. I did have that idea like a while ago. Some of you actually might remember, right? Some of you might actually remember. Shout out to you guys that remember uh, me talking about the... It wasn't for like... The, the idea was for like RTA rewards is skins. I don't remember if it was in a news video. I think it might have been like at the end of a news video. Uh, I was talking about the different news and like, here's some ideas for ways to improve RTA, uh, improve RTA rewards without giving things that are going to be broken, right? Giving a whole bunch of LV5s and stuff. Um, so I said skin RTA. They decided to go for Guild Wars and Guild Siege instead, but, or, wait, are those skins just for Guild Siege? Was that for, yeah, that's for, just for Guild Siege, right? The, the Guild Siege skins. <laughs> yes, there you go. The Guild Siege skins are for Guild Siege. No, but I, I, does it apply to Guild Wars 2? The uh, tournament skins? That is not a Hell Lady. We always make this mistake. Not a Hell Lady. But, uh, yeah, they decided to go for uh, guild content for the skins instead of Arena. But at least, I mean, I'm sure they didn't see my video. Maybe someone was like, oh, that's an interesting idea. And then you know, someone talked to someone else about it, mentioned it to someone else, mentioned some. Maybe it finally made it to come to us, and they, you know, they were like, oh, that's a great idea. But it's probably some, uh, probably a Korean player told them. And that's why they thought it was a good idea. Because if it came from me directly, they would have never done it, right? So. Yeah, must have been, must have been someone, shout out to uh, whoever from 
Korea uh, actually told them. So, Leo Sierra, we got Ryan like a beast. Beast? Why do I want to say Bastet Riders? <laughs> Bastet Riders. Velgel, Garo, Ganymede, any Hell Lady, preferably Beth, Amarna, maybe Arena Speed Lead. Maybe. Maybe Arena Speed Lead. Grim Reaper. When are we gonna get these new two ways, man? So I mean, this is, uh, as we've expected, this is not actually changing anything as far as summoning rates. Obviously, no surprise. I hope that they, may, you know, here's the thing with those, uh, with those siege skins. So this is one of the ones they were hoping for. Look, if we look at these, yep, one of the ones they were hoping for. So we still gotta try to get a Triana. And some boomerangs. But maybe they will eventually do those uh, skins into Arena or RTA or something. Right? Because I think that would be a great incentive for people to actually play. I feel like they're eventually going to actually fix RTA matchmaking. So maybe, maybe not matchmaking, but... Mm, I don't know. See, here's the thing. Like, to fix RTA matchmaking... I think... <sighs> I, you know what? That's its own video. That's its own video. I'll write that down. I'll note that. Yeah, that should be its own video. Because I got so much stuff I want to say about that. And then if I say it here, then people aren't, aren't going to see it. And then if... Uh, someone else starts talking about it in the future. They're gonna be like, "Oh, Bagel, did you know about this person? That had a great idea." I'm like, "That was my idea." Well, we didn't see it. Yeah, cause you skipped the timestamps. You dildos. Uh, okay. <laughs> Tone it down, Bagel. Tone it down. Tone it down. <sighs> it's okay. You guys, you guys, you guys didn't skip the timestamps, so you don't even have to worry about that. All right, so you got a uh, Necro unit for your Triple Inugami team. There you go. What else do we have? Lots more three stars. Merry Christmas! Lots more three stars. New summon portal, same summon RNG. How crazy would it be, though, if the portal gave you, like, 1% increased rates? I, even 1% increased people would take that. They would take that in a heartbeat. They would be like, okay, how much is it back? 1% increased rates? They would still take it. St they, like, that wouldn't even be... Wouldn't even be a thing. They could make the portal itself $100 and nothing else comes with it. And people would still buy it. They'd be like, well, 1% better rates. Not even, not even joking. People would pay $100 easily for that. For 1% better rates. Wind Anubis, not bad. What else? What else you, what else, what else you got for us under that uh, Christmas tree? Full of nat threes. We still need a... <laughs> it feels crazy that we still need a Triana. We still need a... Uh, uh, what else? Wind Boomerang. Fire Boomerang. Orion. Seems crazy to not summon Orion, but I know how it works. I've started alts many times. I know what it's like to not summon Orion and not summon Orion and not summon Orion. Take years. To get a four star. Take years to get a second Lucian, first Lucian, right? Okay, it's gonna be a wind gargoyle day. Uh, I've figured this out. Doesn't take a rocket scientist to figure out it's a wind gargoyle day. Let's see if any other. Argon, hooray! Oh, I know everyone's. Clamoring for an Argon. Okay, we didn't get any new emails back from people. For Saturday morning summons. I'm sure you guys always at all times of day emailing me about fixing your accounts. No worries. 
Those I'm sure have come in, but uh, I'm trying to look at uh, what's what's come in for the um, for the summons. <gasps> you thought it was gonna be something, but it wasn't. But this is this is gonna be a Nat Five Praha. Boom. Just kidding. Underrated unit though. Fun unit. Uh, really good against revives. I mean, that's all he's really good for, but he's he's good against revives. This, oh, th this is another account. This is not the account that had the water boomerang. Right. Right, right. <gasps> oh, I clicked off the thing. That's what I did. Leo, Ciara, Rika, Orion, Laika, Beast Riders, Veljul, Garo, Ganymede, Any Hell Lady, Preferably Beth, Amarna, maybe Arena Speed Lead. Oh, we are on the LDs already. And we have no no exclusives, right? No stones, okay. Put these in storage. Put these in storage. So we're set. So we hope that this is going to give us extra special crunchy RNG. Or maybe, maybe hopefully it gives us better runes for these Lucians. Why? Well, I, 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 oh, how? That came, that, oh, I can't believe that came out. I can't believe that came out. Let's go. Crunchy RNG. Crunchy RNG, please. Should get one, uh, one lightning from these. On average, could get nothing. Could get uh, something crazy. Something crazy. Dark Room Reaper. He may be the next big thing, though. Dark Room Reaper may be like super OP uh, next to a. Remember, he he was pretty good in uh, Lost Centauri. You guys didn't play Lost Centauri. Three of you played Lost Centauri. He was pretty good in Lost Centauri, wasn't he? So. Five left. Oh God! Don't give it. <laughs> Another OP Dark Grim Reaper. But man, they were hyping him up so much. Really? This seems to be giving us worse RNG. Okay. The new portal gives us worse RNG. Don't buy it. Don't, don't buy it at all. Don't buy new portal. Makes your RNG worse. That's what it's looking like already. <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, blue Vampire. Yep. That's definitely... Uh, Definitely what we what we were hoping for. Wind Rakshasa, which you can get from Guild Shop. Pieces. Fire Undyne, again, not not giving us anything amazing. We are not on a really good roll this week, are we? I was he even good in Lost Centuria? I don't even know if he was good in Lost Centuria. There were not that many units in Lost Centuria either. Like, basically, if you fought five matches, you fought against, like, every unit in the game. There was not that much stuff. It was just a beta, though. By the way, it's an open beta. Not uh, it, it, it was an open beta, not a closed beta. Uh, at least by my definition of the betas, because anyone can play it. So it wasn't really closed to a certain group of people that had to qualify anything. It was just anyone could just download and play it. Which, uh, come to us, by the way, thank you for making me sign an NDA to play it when it was literally an open beta, which anyone could effing play. Thank you for that so much, Comptu. They're like, we don't watch your videos, buddy. Yeah, I know. I know. Water Cannon Girl, okay. So at least, <laughs> I mean, at least we're getting some of these here, and it's like, yeah, well, we're gonna get two more Garrows. Watch. Okay, Fire Boomerang. And a water cannon girl, okay. <sighs> and a winsome. Okay, we're not on a great roll. I feel like we're gonna get a dupe from this. Hopefully, hopefully we get one of these units, right? 
pretty meta RTA style units for the most part. Please, no blessing. Please, something good. Please, something good. Ganymede. Very nice. Okay, so that's one of the ones they wanted. It's one of the ones they... Wait, wait. Didn't we say we we're going to get... <laughs> Didn't we say three on average from this? We get one? Jeez. And it was our transcendence, too. Oh, my. Well, we were on, like, two or three average. Two and... We were, it it, it should have been, like, two and a half, right? But still, we only got one, which is not... Not great. Not great RNG. Not a great week. And we got no LD Lightning. Like this week, this is a bad week. I figured out the first two accounts were not crazy because we are saving all of the RNG for this one. We have like 30 LDs here. Yeah, we have 32 LDs, three SWCs. We have a handful of legendaries. 300 between the mysticals and all of these. We have like 300. No blessings. Cool. Okay. What are they hoping to get? Nothing! All three stars. Anything new is cool. Wait. Are you missing any three stars? We're gonna get a lot of those. Wind Sniper! Okay. Well, that's off to a start of some kind. Actually, I have not played with him too much since after the buff. Because he was buffed and he was actually being used in... Not, not a lot in Special League, but a little bit in Special League. With, uh, hey, what are new is? We're. It's a theme week, isn't it? I feel like we're getting a lot of the same units. Wind Sniper, what are new is? Right? Let's do the same things. Every three star in the game. It's been free to play for most of my summer short career, so I finally decided to buy some packs and support Comp to us against my better judgment. Bad. Bad idea, because now you're going to get nothing. Comp to us is not going to reward you. They're going to be like, hey, thanks for the money. That's it. <laughs> Just hey, thanks for the money. Uh, no need to ask me any questions. I trust your picks. There's nothing to pick, though. There's no blessings, so there's nothing to pick. Um, feel free to do whatever rituals it might get me that. Oh, we got. Let's do a ritual. Yeah. Let's uh, let's sacrifice your three Inugamis. Sacrifice this cat. Hold on. Is this cat toxic enough? Should we sacrifice? Yeah. Let's let's sacrifice her. Summon. Boom. And we'll go here. We'll go here. We'll go plant. And you know that the blue one is first. It's not always the blue one first. But I noticed that the things we sacrifice, those flowers, I don't know. The flowers are, are, are the same color as the things we sacrifice. Thought maybe it's just coincidence that the last few were like that. But those those are not always the same uh, in the same order. So maybe that's what that that's what we did wrong for the first two. We didn't sacrifice anything. No, we did. Wait, did we? Did we sacrifice? We ninja. Did we sacrifice those things? Nafis already have. Vanessa, Juno, Brandia. I'm like translating because he didn't put those names specifically. He just put the families. Okay, well, well, hey, he's got a dark puller queen. Very nice. She's a rough one. She's she's rough to use. Like, you can't just bring her in everywhere. Like, there's some units that you can just bring in everywhere. Um, I have the dark puller queen. You never see me use it. I mean, sometimes, some, well, you never see me use it. I use it every so often. Not a whole lot, but she is a rough unit to actually use. Because you can't take her in everywhere. Again, some units you can just take everywhere, but she is not one of those. She is very specific usage to counter cleaves. We still have music, right? Yeah, we still have music. It's low on my end. Martial Arts. Water Sniper. Okay, so we're getting more snipers. We're getting like the same units all day. Ganymede! Beth! For the person that didn't want a Beth! 
Congratulations. It's new, though. At least it's new. Sacrifice blue monster. Plant blue flower. Get blue nat five. Tell me we're not getting the same units. I feel. Tell me we're not getting the same units. We're getting the same four stars. For all of these accounts, we're getting the same four stars. Bagel, there's only so many four stars you get. Yeah, but we're getting. Look, we we got a few. Anubis, we got a few snipers, we got a few, um, a few gargoyles. How many Lucians did we get? How many fire, uh, well, yeah, how many, how many, how many Jokers? Just overall, how many Sky Dancers? We're getting the same four stars. You guys are noticing this, right? That's an interesting coincidence, if it is a coincidence. I don't know, man. I don't know how much I believe, because we already actually discussed this years ago. It was like, um, cause a former guildmate mentioned, he's like, you're pulling like a lot of, a lot of weeks you pull the same units, like the same four stars, like consistently throughout the, throughout the week. He's like, there's something to that. And I was like, you're crazy, but I don't know, man. Sometimes I wonder. Sometimes I wonder. Maybe it's just a coincidence. Maybe it's not a coincidence. That's all I'm saying. 128 more. Another fire undine. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. We've pulled her before too this week. Interesting. Maybe coincidence, right? Maybe coincidence that we keep getting the same, uh, same four stars. Okay, so this is actually, that, that's new. That's new. Probably. Or maybe we got him before too. I don't know. I wasn't paying too much attention. I mean, I'm not saying it, we can't get other things aside from the ones that we've already pulled, obviously, but... Seems like some are more common than others in any specific week. But that's how RNG works anyway. Right? Things cluster together. True RNG is not... Like... One of every kind, and then it goes again. I don't know if I'm making any sense to you guys. In, in my head it makes sense, but I didn't say anything in, that was actually in my head. So... But yeah. Actual RNG is like... Sometimes there's groups of things that makes it seem coincidental, but it's just RNG is is like that. True randomness is like that. So, but code is not true randomness. That's the thing. Code is co code is actually all based on time in the first place. That's how cuz you have to code it somehow. Computers don't know what random means. So you have to kind of like make up your own fake random in programming. The programmers that I'm that, that are watching this uh, they know what I'm talking about, but a lot of people that don't understand programming don't know. They're like, no, Michael, it's just random. You tell the computer, random something, and then they put out a random something. It's like they, we, the computer doesn't understand the concept of random because you need to teach it random, and then you need to teach it from something. So, yeah, it has to come from somewhere. So you have to teach it how to in interpret random. It's just nerdy stuff. Listen, you don't need to know. You don't need to know any of that stuff. It's just nerdy stuff. But, yeah. Another Shayna. Hmm. Interesting. If we get another Ganymede, though, I'm just saying. If we get another Ganymede, let's see. Well, we got we got a Beth, right? But it is something that someone actually pointed out to me previously, like years ago. That certain units seem to be more common on certain weeks. Almost as if, almost as if like, exclusive summons were half applied to the mystical scrolls. And certain units, just like you can only get a certain pool of units here that in mysticals or or other scrolls that certain other units are more likely to appear in certain weeks again it's all just like it's 
kind of nonsense because it's like, how do you really, like, it sounds like a conspiracy theory, right? And maybe it's just BS, but just interesting stuff to, uh, to think about. Or maybe I'm just overtired and I need to sleep. But it's not, it's not me. The first, the first person to actually point that out was not me, though. So, I'm just noticing today that it seems like we're getting a lot of the same four stars. And it reminded me of when someone said that years ago. And I said, you're stupid. You need to lay off the, the smoky smokies and the sauce, the saucy saucies. I was trying to tell him to lay off the barbecue. All right, listen. Like, you and your... It's just dad jokes. It's just dad... Because you smoke, like, brisket, and then you put the barbecue... So whatever. Listen, listen. Next on OMG... For no, 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 no. Uh, okay. So... <laughs> I'm going to bed. I'll see you guys later. I'll see you guys later. I'll see you... I'll see you an actual Saturday morning. How many more days? Oh my god, we have like 27, 26 more days of the, uh, something like that of the year. It's almost over, guys. 2020 is almost over. Oh, oh, thank god. Oh, what a year. Thank god. Win Sylphid, I don't think we got her yet, though, this week. I don't think we got her. I'm gonna sleep so crazy tonight. So I, sometimes I sleep crazy regardless. Uh, no, I'm gonna sleep. I feel like I'm already, like my body is just like, yes, sleep now. I'm like, no, no, we gotta summon more Nat 3s. And the body's like, no, sleep now. I'm like, no, we summon more Nat 3s. Nat 3s first, then sleep. Kind of me, boom. Let's see it. See you again, Another win, Sylphid. Close enough. I mean, not close to Ganymede, just close that it's a, something we already pulled. He's really hoping for Ganymede. Does he even want a Ganymede? Okay. He fed, why are you feeding a Nat 5? He told me he fed a Nat 5. Don't feed Nat 5s. Now I'm awake. Don't feed Nat 5s. What? Ugh. Please, people, stop feeding Nat 5s. I know they may not be very exciting when you get them. That doesn't mean they're not going to get balance patched. Okay, please don't feed that one. Congratulations, don't feed that. Why would you admit that you fed it? You know what I'm going to say. You. Maybe that was the point. Maybe he wanted me to... Get enraged. Feeds Nat Fives. Give me a break. Feeds Nat Fives. Haven't we learned our lessons? Haven't we learned our lessons over the years of not feeding Nat Fives because you don't know what's going to get buffed and changed and buffed and more buffed and buffed and changed? Like feeding Ciara and Ganymede. Speaking of Ganymede. At least we got two Nat 5s so far, though. That's not bad. And two AoE defense breakers. Two that you could even run like bruisers, right? Because one's already a bruiser. Like, one's definitely a bruiser. And then this one, you can kind of run as a bruiser, too. She's an attack type unit, but you could run like a hybrid for her because she has a HP leader skill for Arena. So you could do her in like um, a Shield Will Cleave Team. I always say Shield Will Cleave Teams. And then, like, when was the last time I actually brought out Shield Will Cleave Teams for anything? I'm always like, yeah, you could just use the Shield Will Cleave team for this. And then I'm like, let's do something else. Let's do a little Potato Boy monster. You guys are probably like, yeah, no, do a Shield Will Cleave team. I don't know if they're, like, some of them may just be unruined at this point. They shouldn't be, but um, one of my guildmates was mentioning earlier today, actually, um, that some of my... <laughs> Some of my units are unruined. That he's like, uh, I'm pretty sure you want to know that they're unruined, and I'm like, or they're missing runes, and I'm like, yeah, that's that's pretty common because things keep getting changed for the next video because this thing needs to be. We're gonna play with this in the next video, and then we change this, and we play with that in the next video, we change that, and then like 
my accounts are a lot of them are a mess and like missing runes here and there like i can never keep things fully ruined because there's always a new video that needs to be done and we have to show this with runes and you don't have like a plethora of runes to even go through uh, I feel like I'm not gonna- I feel like I'm not the only one that that happens to, though. I feel like, uh, probably the other YouTubers as well. Like, probably Sean B, that probably happens to him, but he's got less accounts to worry about, and he only has the one, so... Um... Maybe it's less of a thing for him, but... 69. Perfect! Nat 5. Boom. Drunken Master. More like a... Never mind. I was gonna say Obabo Master, but whatever. Hopefully, we get uh, some kind of lightning from here. Let's. F you know what? We're gonna zap Bella. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Bella. We're gonna zap you. He said. Wait, wait, wait. He said. Feel free to do whatever rituals that might get me that luck. Don't usually have good luck when I save for a big summon session, so maybe you can turn that around. We are gonna unsummon this. We are gonna unsummon this. Two great units, by the way. Two very, very good units. Um, let's go building. Let's go plant. Let's go dark. Boom. And let's go light. This better do something. We just fed two Inugamis. What are they saying? Game of Thrones? Gods be good? <laughs> let's see. Let's see it. Let's see. Don't, don't, don't make that for nothing, game. Don't make that a waste. And then no LD lightning at all. I guess Charmy got everyone's luck. Okay, nothing. Okay, well. Hey, we got a prom. Fantastic. Seven left. We really better get something from these. That's pretty sad. What do we do? 30? If this was... Okay. Jokes aside. I know. I talk about Epic 7 sometimes. Yes, it triggers people. If this was Epic 7, we would have got 10 on average. It's one. Like, the average for here was like 1.5 out of what we had. Epic 7 would have been 10, on average. There was, there's no way you go through that many in Epic 7 and, uh, and, and, and don't get any lightning. So, this is just ridiculous. I'm not talking about like Epic 7 better than Summoning Scrolls. I'm talking about that su the summoning rates for here for LD Scrolls is absolute garbage. That should have been changed six years ago. That should have never been this bad. Well, fortunately, we got another Nat 5, but... <sighs> LD Lightning. I don't see how anyone would ever buy any LD Scrolls for any reason. They're so garbage. They're absolute garbage. LD Scrolls are absolute garbage. It's the absolute biggest waste of money. Period. It's just all garbage. That's the, that's the biggest way to just blow money on nothing for your account. That's not just me saying that for this week. That's me, like, I've always felt that way. Like, hey, another wind gargoyle. I've always felt that way, though. That's why I really don't buy that. Uh, I'll get, like, the other ones every so often. Like, you you, you see what I get on, uh, on videos. But uh, I don't, like, do LD packs, so... I think they're terrible value. Terrible, terrible, terrible value. Because you get basically, the, the, the rates are 1 in almost 300 for an LD5. And then LD4s, half of them are going to be Hall of Heroes anyway. So, it's like 1 in every 35 scrolls, LD scroll, and they're $30 each, right? 1 in every 35 scrolls is going to be something that you are excited about. So that's $1,000 to summon something you're, like, excited about. That's ridiculous. That's 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 beyond ridiculous. A thousand dollars? I would literally just like anything else. I would rather wipe my butt crack with money. 
than by LD Scrolls. It's so garbage. It's so, 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 so garbage. It's so beyond garbage. Worst value of, yeah, I mean, oh my God. Here's how you know it's bad value. Raid Shadow Legends put Summoner's War LD rates to shame. Raid Shadow, because I mean, not that the rates are better. I don't think the rates are better. They do have boosted double rates, right? So number one, they have double rates. So you can just summon all of your voids, which are like the LD equivalents, at double, uh, at, at, at the ones where you get increased rates, right? The portal glows and it's like double rates for, you know, sometimes they have double rates for one, for one thing, some that, sometimes they have double rates for another thing. Um, so that's number one. Number two is if you buy uh, void packs, that's why, but like when we did the Raid Shadow Legend sponsors, I was like, oh yeah, we'll buy some Void Packs. Buy some Void Packs. Like they're actually pretty, like it's for the same amount of money, like for example, like $30, it'll give you like five scrolls. Or five shards, it's not scrolls, it's shards. So it gives you like five times the amount, so. <sighs> or sometimes they even have crazier packs, like 50 and you get like 12 or something like that. It's like. It's, 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 you get much more. I'm not saying Raid Shadow Legends better. I'm just saying, um, like, the, the rates are so bad. You get such a bad value in Summoner's War that all these other gacha games with rates that are just like gacha game rates, which are not good rates, and you still spend a bunch of money for little things in video games. Like, all of these puts, like, Summoner's War to shame. That's not good. Come to us. When your rates are that bad that Raid Shadow Legends is putting you to shame, that's not, that's not good. They don't care. People still buy them. For whatever reason, people still buy them. Congratulations. Come to us like, shut up. That was actually, you know what? That was an SWC special. So that was one of the most wanted units. So, so it actually was true what I said at the beginning. I was like, this is, this is going to be all our RNG for the week is going to be on this one account. Yeah, one, two. Well, actually, it was only four. Still, that's pretty. That's not. That's not bad. Four. Did they have? They didn't have a perna. I know that. Did they have a rocky? They did not have a rocky. They did not have a perna. Uh, let's check the Ratesh. Did they have a Ratesh? And then a Beth. Looks like they. Where's Ratesh? They did not have a Ratesh. And let's check Beth. Did not have. So all of those are new. All of those are new. So all the RNG was indeed not from LDs, not from LDs. And then the rates, like they such a bad value to buy the packs. And then the rates are absolute garbage too. Why can't I ever shut my mouth? Really? That's why, why? I just keep, I, I just, when I'm pissed off, I just, <sighs> I just let it, let it loose, whatever. Anyway, I think that's it. I think we are actually done because no one else emailed back. So that's it for this one. Quick Saturday morning summons today. You got a, a, a short rant instead of a long rant. Uh, anyway, that's it for this one. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Hope you guys get some better rates and don't spend money and just get crazy nonsense uh, for free this week. Uh, anyway, that's it for this one. Hope you guys enjoy. I will see you as always in the next one.